morning and welcome to this new edition of the Q&A with Eshali. I hope you had a wonderful weekend. A bit cold around here. Still, we've got a couple of questions today. What type of wines do you use for your training? I do trainings myself and I tend to go for lower end wines to keep the prices down. What do you think? What kind of wines do you use? I tend to use quality wines. I mean, price shouldn't really get into the equation at that point. Of course, price is going to be important later, so you can sell your training. But I think if you're using low quality wines or really cheap wines, of course, it's going to be good because you're going to have low prices for the training. But when your students are going to try the wines, they're going to concentrate on, on the wines being blah. They're not going to concentrate on what you say and on the message you're trying to get them understand. So that's why whenever I do training, I mean, if it's a shabby training, I'm going to have a selection of good, very good, amazing wines. Because you can't really make a point. I mean, it can be about Bordeaux, it can be anything, but it can be about great varieties. If you don't have good wines, how can you actually make a point? I mean, that's at least my opinion. Again, if you're really about doing cheap trainings, but I'm not sure that's a real good plan for, for the future, because you're always going to find someone who's able to do something cheaper. Maybe go for, for low quality wines. If you want to be there and be part of the game for a long time, you know, customers will understand that they have to pay more to get amazing wines. The other question, do you sell the pictures that are outside your shop? I do. I tend to do a bit of photography and that's pictures you can see on Facebook or wherever. And I sometimes print them out on uh, aluminium. So it's a bit more sturdy and the result is always amazing. Uh, so yeah, yeah, if you want those pictures, you can always call me or send me an email. Here we go. If you have any other questions, send them by next week. I hope you're going to have a wonderful week. Keep on tasting. Bye-bye.